Welcome back, fellow travelers, to the Insight Station. I'm your host, SK Sa, and today, we're embarking on a captivating journey to one of China's most extraordinary landmarks, the Temple of Heaven in Beijing. The Temple of Heaven, recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, holds a special place in Chinese history and culture. It was constructed during the Ming Dynasty and served as a sacred sanctuary for imperial worship. Let's delve deeper into its rich heritage and explore its remarkable architecture. The Temple of Heaven's architecture is a testament to the ingenuity and precision of ancient Chinese craftsmanship. Its design is not only visually stunning but also carries deep symbolic meanings. The focal point of the temple complex is the Hall of Prayer for Good Harvests, an architectural masterpiece. Its towering triple-tiered circular structure, with its richly colored roof and intricate carvings, is a sight to behold. The hall is supported by massive wooden pillars, carefully fitted together without the use of any nails, showcasing the remarkable craftsmanship of the time. Moving further into the complex, we come across the Imperial Vault of Heaven. This smaller circular building sits atop a single terrace and is surrounded by a beautiful circular wall known as the Echo Wall. It is said that whispers made at one point can be clearly heard at another, thanks to the wall's unique acoustic properties. At the heart of the Temple of Heaven lies the Circular Mound Altar, a circular stone platform adorned with exquisite patterns and designs. This sacred altar was where the Emperor, as the Son of Heaven, would offer sacrifices to the heavens during important ceremonies. The precise layout of the altar reflects the ancient Chinese belief in the circular nature of the universe and the cosmic order. The architectural elements of the Temple of Heaven, such as the use of vibrant colors, intricate carvings, and precise geometrical designs, are not merely decorative but also hold profound symbolism. The combination of circular and square shapes represents the fusion of heaven and earth, while the colors used on the buildings, predominantly blue and gold, symbolize the celestial and imperial nature of the site. Overall, the Temple of Heaven's architecture is a harmonious blend of aesthetics, symbolism, and functionality. It reflects the deep spiritual connection between the Emperor and the Divine, showcasing the reverence and importance placed on the celestial realm in Chinese culture. The Temple of Heaven wasn't merely a grand architectural marvel, it was a sacred space where elaborate rituals and worship took place. These rituals were of paramount importance to the emperors of ancient China, who believed in the close relationship between the divine and earthly realms. The emperors would visit the Temple of Heaven annually, usually during the winter solstice, to perform rituals and offer sacrifices to heaven. These ceremonies were known as the heavenly worship and were intended to ensure the prosperity and well-being of the empire, particularly through a bountiful harvest. One of the central rituals performed within the temple complex was the ceremony of prayer for good harvests. This ceremony took place in the hall of prayer for good harvests, where the emperor, dressed in ceremonial attire, would kneel and offer sacrifices and prayers to heaven. The emperor's role in these rituals was seen as that of a mediator between heaven and earth, seeking blessings and favorable conditions for the agricultural livelihood of the people. The rituals at the Temple of Heaven were accompanied by strict protocols and symbolisms. The layout of the temple complex itself held significance, with the buildings and pathways representing the hierarchy and order of the universe. The number nine, considered auspicious in Chinese culture, was often incorporated into the designs and rituals. Additionally, the symbolic elements used in the ceremonies held deep meanings. For example, the color red, symbolizing good fortune, was prominently used during the rituals. The choice of sacrificial offerings, such as fruits, grains, and livestock, reflected the importance of agricultural abundance. These rituals were not only religious but also had social and political implications. The successful performance of these ceremonies was seen as a validation of the emperor's legitimacy and his ability to rule with the support of heaven. The entire process was meticulously planned and executed, involving numerous officials and courtiers who played specific roles in the ceremonies. While the ancient rituals may no longer be performed today, the Temple of Heaven remains a symbol of the deep reverence and spiritual connection the Chinese people had with the heavens. 
It stands as a reminder of the importance placed on maintaining harmony between the divine forces and earthly existence. Beyond its religious and architectural significance, the Temple of Heaven holds immense cultural importance in Chinese society. It serves as a symbol of the enduring traditions and beliefs that have shaped the country's history. The temple's design and layout embody the fundamental principles of Chinese philosophy, particularly the concept of harmony between heaven and earth. This concept, rooted in ancient Chinese cosmology, emphasizes the interconnectedness and balance between the celestial and earthly realms. The Temple of Heaven, with its meticulous architectural arrangements and symbolic elements, encapsulates this belief system. Throughout history, the temple grounds have been more than a site of worship, they have been a place for communal activities and cultural expressions. Today, the surrounding Temple of Heaven Park serves as a vibrant social hub where locals gather to partake in traditional practices and recreational activities. One common sight in the park is groups of people practicing Tai Chi, an ancient Chinese martial art that emphasizes harmony of mind, body, and spirit. The serene atmosphere of the temple grounds provides an ideal setting for individuals to connect with their inner selves, cultivate wellness, and carry on a centuries-old tradition. Musical performances are another integral part of the cultural significance of the Temple of Heaven. The park often hosts musicians playing traditional Chinese instruments, filling the air with melodies that echo through the ancient trees. These performances not only entertain visitors but also serve as a means of cultural preservation, ensuring that the enchanting tunes of the past continue to resonate in the present. The Temple of Heaven Park is also a gathering place for locals, who come together for socializing, games, and leisure activities. Families and friends spend time bonding over a game of Chinese chess, practicing calligraphy, or engaging in traditional pastimes. These activities foster a sense of community and keep the traditions alive, connecting people to their cultural heritage. Furthermore, the park serves as a venue for important cultural festivals and celebrations throughout the year. During occasions such as the Spring Festival or the Mid-Autumn Festival, the Temple of Heaven becomes a center of festive joy, with colorful decorations, lively performances, and a vibrant atmosphere that brings people together in celebration. The Temple of Heaven's cultural significance extends far beyond its physical structures. It represents a living testament to the deep-rooted values, customs, and artistic expressions that have shaped Chinese civilization. It serves as a reminder of the importance of preserving and cherishing cultural heritage, fostering a sense of pride and identity among the Chinese people. The Temple of Heaven is not only a place of architectural beauty and cultural significance, but also holds a treasure trove of intriguing facts and captivating legends. Let's delve into some of the lesser-known aspects that make this place even more fascinating. One fascinating fact about the Temple of Heaven is its meticulous astronomical alignment. The entire layout of the complex follows precise astronomical principles. The Hall of Prayer for Good Harvests, for instance, is built with specific dimensions and orientations to align with celestial bodies. This intricate astronomical knowledge is a testament to the advanced understanding of ancient Chinese astronomers. Legend has it that the echo wall surrounding the imperial vault of heaven possesses a unique acoustic phenomenon. The wall, with its smooth curvature, allows even the faintest whispers to travel along its surface and be heard clearly on the opposite side. Visitors often engage in playful whispers, testing the phenomenon and marveling at the remarkable acoustics. Another intriguing legend associated with the Temple of Heaven is the tale of the Nine Dragon Juniper. It is said that during the construction of the temple, a massive lightning bolt struck a juniper tree. From the stump, nine new branches emerged, resembling nine dragons. The tree has become a symbol of resilience and good fortune, standing as a testament to the indomitable spirit of the Chinese people. Within the temple complex, there is a stone known as the Dragon's Well Stone. This stone, shaped like a well, is believed to have mystical properties. According to legend, if you stand on the stone and speak, your voice will be amplified and carried to the heavens. It adds an air of mystery and wonder to the already enchanting surroundings. The colors used in the Temple of Heaven's architecture also hold symbolic significance. 
The predominant use of blue and gold represents the heavens and the imperial status of the emperor. Blue, associated with the sky and water, signifies the celestial realm, while gold represents the emperor's authority and divinity. These are just a few of the captivating facts and legends associated with the Temple of Heaven. Exploring the stories and mysteries surrounding this extraordinary site adds depth and intrigue to the experience, allowing us to appreciate the layers of history and folklore that have intertwined over the centuries. As we come to the end of our journey through the Temple of Heaven, we reflect upon the awe-inspiring beauty, rich history, and profound cultural significance of this remarkable place. The Temple of Heaven stands as a testament to the enduring traditions and beliefs that have shaped Chinese civilization. Its architectural splendor, with its intricate designs and meticulous astronomical alignments, showcases the remarkable skills of ancient craftsmen and their deep understanding of the cosmos. Beyond its architectural marvels, the Temple of Heaven holds a spiritual and cultural significance that resonates with the Chinese people. It represents the harmonious relationship between heaven and earth, a concept deeply ingrained in Chinese philosophy and beliefs. The rituals and worship that took place within these sacred grounds were not only acts of religious devotion but also political and social events of great importance. The ceremonies performed by emperors at the Temple of Heaven were seen as a means to ensure the prosperity and well-being of the empire, as well as a validation of the emperor's mandate to rule. Today, the Temple of Heaven continues to be a vibrant cultural hub, where locals gather to practice Tai Chi, engage in traditional activities, and celebrate important festivals. It serves as a reminder of the importance of preserving cultural heritage, fostering a sense of pride and connection to their roots. Visiting the Temple of Heaven is a journey that transcends time, allowing us to immerse ourselves in the magnificence of the past while embracing the living traditions that continue to thrive today. So, whether you have the opportunity to witness the sunrise at the Hall of Prayer for Good Harvests or take part in the lively festivities during a cultural festival, the Temple of Heaven promises a profound and unforgettable experience. Thank you for joining me on this exploration of the Temple of Heaven. I hope it has ignited your curiosity, enriched your understanding of Chinese history and culture, and inspired you to seek out the wonders that await us in every corner of our world. If you found this video informative and captivating, don't forget to subscribe to the Insight Station for more captivating adventures. You can find links to our other intriguing videos on the screen. Thank you for joining me today, and remember, keep seeking knowledge and embracing the mysteries that surround us.